Chris. I love you. My heart is with you wherever you are. 100 days of torture. That's what a Bentonville mother says she's been living since her son went missing in Mexico. She says her son, Luis Davila, visiting his girlfriend in Mexico when he was kidnapped on the drive back to the U.S. 4029's Una Lee reports. I miss a lot of him. Luis is a really good son. 32-year-old Luis Davila has now been missing for 100 days. His mother, Laura, tells me he was an all-star soccer player at Bentonville High, is an avid hiker, and loves to travel. She says Luis was visiting his girlfriend in Monterey, Mexico, when he was kidnapped on his drive back. He was last seen at a convenience store south of the border in Nuevo Laredo on March 29th. She says this is a picture his kidnapper sent her the next day, threatening to kill him if they didn't send money. She says she was extorted seven times, and after the seventh, they went silent. Still no sign of her son and no sign of his kidnappers. Tell me where is my son? Bring me by my son. Family friend and translator Gabriela Rodriguez says it's been agonizing. There is nothing like if he was he's completely gone like his cell phone his work computer um his um um his car they have not found anything they've spoken to 10 other families going through the same situation from oklahoma georgia and texas kidnapped loved ones extortion threats then silence that okay. is not just Luis, that there are 11 citizens of the U.S. that are yeah. kidnapped, yeah, that were kidnapped in the same area. Okay. Um, because we want to make sure that it's, it's known that it's not a one person thing and that this is affecting families in the U.S. The U.S. Department of State tells me there's a travel alert for Nuevo Laredo. The department's Bureau of Diplomatic Security cites raised concern over highway disappearances in the border city. They are telling travelers to avoid using this highway between Monterey and the Texas border. The family tells me they are in constant contact with the FBI. The FBI believes Luis is likely the victim of a kidnapping. Laura is pleading for her son's return pleading for any help and praying her son can hear our story. Be strong, Luis. Be strong. Keep strong. Don't lose the pain. You know, you know who is your, your Lord. Keep praying, Luis. Keep praying. Una Lee, 4029 News.